Hello YouTube friends and welcome back to So Aldo. On today's video, I am going to show you how to make a teddy bear clothes from scratch. So if you would like to see how, then keep on watching. So the first thing I did was measure the body of the teddy bear and right here I marked it about 15 inches and then you also want to figure out how long the dress is going to be. Then I transferred that measurement on the scrap fabric that I have here. If you recognize the material, it was actually a leftover fabric from a thrifted transformations that I did a few months ago. To add some extra detail on the neckline, I decided to add a mini ruffle. So I'm basically just going to cut two strips of fabrics that is twice the length of the dress panel and this strip is about two inches wide i'm going to stitch on one end to form a long strip of fabric this sewing project is great for beginners because it doesn't involve a lot of sewing it's basically sewing straight stitches and also a great way to get rid of your scrap fabrics Right after that, I am going to hem the ruffle. I'm just simply going to roll hem it. It's much easier if you are going to press it so it stay in place. After that, I am going to base stitch it on the top edge of the strip. And then I am going to gather it to match the width of the dress panel. And then I will pop a few pins here and there just to hold the ruffle on the dress panel. And then I am going to sew it across right here. And by the way, if you would like a more flowy dress instead of doing a 15 inches width, you can do 17 inches instead. By the way, you guys, this is actually a very good cost-effective gift idea. So if you are searching for handmade gift ideas, you might just found one right here on my channel. At the last minute, I decided to add some lace trim just to give it some extra detail and a pop of red on the hemline and I thought it is super super cute. Just going to sew it across. Nothing special so it's pretty easy for a beginner. It's time to finish the neckline. I just simply fold in the raw edge and top stitch the ruffle. Then it's time to join the back seam. I just match the right sides of the fabrics and then sew lengthwise. And then I put it on the teddy bear and it actually looks super cute. As you can see, it's a little fitted. So if you would like a more flowy dress, you can just add a few more inches just to make it a little flowy. Now it's time to add the shoulder straps. I will be doing a self-tie shoulder straps that is also adjustable and it's about 8 inches long. The idea is you want it to be long enough so you can actually tie a proper bow and I just use a quarter of an inch bias tape that is just sitting around in my stash and this is the final sundress I absolutely love how it turned out and it's super easy to make you guys it only took me less than 10 minutes to complete this sewing project 
going to be a perfect handmade gift ideas if you are searching for some handmade toy ideas you might just found one here on so aldo it's not that expensive if you will buy this outfit from build a bear it's going to cost you like at least 10 bucks if you would like to see more videos from so aldo be sure to hit subscribe and hit the notification so you will get notified whenever i post a new one i will see you next time bye